Hello everyone, welcome to this video, uh, audio commentary reflection on a previous milestone uh, accomplished and achieved within my ongoing uh, Life Glider journey series. Now because this video is so short, I'm going to explain uh, whilst showing you the video and I'm going to pause it. Uh, throughout the video uh, to explain some stuff. So in this video, uh, myself and my wife discovered that applying uh, tightness helps to increase uh, and enhance uh, stabilization, balance, synergy, um, and rhythm whilst walking. Um, so I'm just going to let the video play a little bit more, and then I'm going to pause it. Um, I'll say here. So, because the belt, sorry, because the belt has been applied with uh, additional uh, tightness, my balance has started to see a noticeable uh, increase and uh, confidence has been risen and raised. Uh, resilience has been in, uh, increased and uh, overall mental well-being uh, is start um, is started to be positive um, is, um, has started to be positively impacted. Now when it comes to walking uh, in the life glider it's very important that you try and get a rhythm, synergy, and synchronization uh, between yourself and your legs alongside the life glider. So all, so all those components need to work in harmony to keep the functional, to keep the uh, fluidity within the functional, within the functionality. So, as well. And here's a tip, you need to wear uh, boots or trainers because the weight that you apply to lifting your foot is going to be a good indication of the rhythm and the functionality, no sorry, the rhythm and the synergy you need to, uh, you need to keep consistent. So think of it like a tempo you know try and think of it like that you know try and think of it like that um and boots also um don't get in the way of the wheels because if you wear slippers or sandals or anything like that they will uh get in, they will get in the way of the wheels and then that would mess up the synergy and the synchronization and the harmony of walking uh, we've also discovered that the maximum tightness actually uh, actually simulates natural walking and it does improve confidence resilience determination independence by a by a long mile um, and that that's the closest you would ever get to experiencing what it would be like to walk uh, to walk more naturally um, and, that, and that's because of the belt uh, tightness. It will provide some uh, some minor uh, some minor uh, some minor irritation because of the pressure that has been uh, that has been applied but if you uh, can push yourself past that and utilize it to keep going then that would be um, really good to maintain the balance and the stabilization it's very important to understand that yourself hmm? sorry I'm not sorry uh, I'm not yourself and uh, the life glider alongside with uh with your walking they all 
work in harmony. They need to be as one unit whilst walking. So try and get yourself in that mindset. Try and under try and understand that rhythm and then try and follow it through. So it's all about synchronization um, patterns because that would help to uh, keep your walking uh, walking consistent. And it does it it, I mean, it doesn't consume stamina. It uh, it it um, it preserves stamina uh, even whilst you're running or speed walking. So don't worry about so don't worry about the stamina. Just keep your head held high. Focus on where you want to go. Start building that synergy, that synchronization. Follow it through. Don't don't be scared and everything will be fine. But make sure to wear trainers or boots because of the weight. Each time you lift up your foot and put it back on the ground, that the weight that will the weight that is applied to lifting your shoe would be a great uh, in, um, in, um, indication of the tempo or the tempo or the speed you want to be walking, and then that would, uh, and then that would uh, automatically, um, that that would automatically initiate a pattern, synchronization, a rhythm, a synergy, within your mind. And personally, that is a great way of going about keeping that consistency, keeping that uh, fluidity, that you know that that balance, that stabilization whilst walking. Uh, always focus on where you want to go and always keep in mind that you are in control of the speed. It's not like in the walking frame where you go fast or in any other frames where you can go fast or speed walk and feel like you're not in control because the frame is carrying that um, Velocity, that momentum that you initially, um, um, that you initially uh, activated, but the life glider will work with you as long as, as long as you work with it and have a bond or like a synchronization and keep in mind that you are one. It will uh, be the best thing ever. So as you can see, my back is is uh, is starting to become more straighter because of the um, because of the stabilization and the tightness of the belt. The belt is key. The more tighter you got the belt, the more positive impacts your body, your mental health, your confidence will will become. Um, overall, overall, just to wrap up, this was a personal eye opener for me and my wife, and we have uh, applied um, maximum tightness ever since to keep that fluidity, that that natural walking synergy rhythm going throughout the days or wherever we decide to go. Um, so this concludes my video. I hope you enjoyed it. Sorry for the te sorry for the technical hiccups in this video. Um, please look forward to uh, future audio commentaries. Thank you.